Meet John Tyndall. He has been living at PATH, formerly known as Casa Esperanza, for nearly a year and volunteers in the kitchen daily. It's a feeling of self-worth. In two weeks, he will be moving into his own apartment, but says he still plans to help out regularly. Why? Because programs like Community Kitchen have helped turn his life around. It really is a tremendous help. I'm very fortunate, so are the rest of us. John and PATH Facilities Coordinator Jaime Galindo pick up pounds of perishable and non-perishable foods from local grocery stores each morning. Donations from a Trader Joe's, and Whole Foods, and Lazy Acres. Whatever they don't take gets redistributed to other community centers in need. From bread to meat and produce, food that has either slightly damaged packaging or is nearing its shelf life is donated. Stores might sell this for resale at a discounted price, but we choose to pass it on to, uh, to the community. It's so nice to be able to be able to offer a healthy meal alternative and know that it's fresh. Path Kitchen chef Lorenzo Martinez says his favorite part of the job is getting creative. It's like being an artist, like painting a picture and knowing what you're going to create. And it gives him purpose knowing the food he serves is of the best quality. They, they're like me, so if I don't want it, I'm not going to give it to them. But the community values is uh, healthy lifestyles and healthy living, so if we can start that, you know, even with the groups that are at need, so it's a really special thing, it'll, it'll give you chills. And John's favorite meal? Oh, Lorenzo makes a wonderful steak. 